There we go. That's nice and sexy. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the chaos. My name is Live the Tech, and today I need to correct some errors that I made last time. Uh, we lost our book of um, Lobotomy Corporation and our book of Distortion. Um, I'm just going to double check to make sure I got those back to see what I still need. Okay, so I got my book of L Corp. I got that. Okay, I got all those. So we're good. But first and foremost, we're going to go here and we're going to fight Child of the Galaxy, which I'm probably going to lose a couple times. Last time I had this huge problem where I wasn't paying attention, but now I'm back. I'm ready to... What was that? I'm ready to fight. Also, you need to open your eyes so you can pay attention. Stores 20% of HP at the start of the scene. So that's already going to be bad. Um, Lots of burning damage is going to be helpful. Don't leave me. HP does not go below one. Become staggered upon taking lethal damage. After two scenes, recovered HP equal to current HP of another ally. If all allies have one HP at the start of the scene, die. Okay, so... I need to think about this. First off, I have to get them both down at the same time. That's going to be tough. So I really can't just focus on one and not the other. All right, so we're going to try to burn both of them if we can. Because I think that's going to be fairly effective. I need to switch that around. No, I don't. Because I can't interrupt him anyways. Okay. Boom. Boom. Okay. So they're burning, but they're also doing other stuff. Okay, we're going to stagger, or we're going to successful page to reduce max stagger resist. Um, we need to start staggering them right now. Oh, yeah. Uh, you. Okay, so they recovered literally everything. That is not good. Okay, um, this will still bleed them, although it's not perfect. Oh, god damn it, I hit the wrong button! Well, good news is he staggered. Nice. Um, okay, uh, he's staggered. Go for it. Hooray. Um, yeah. All right, and he's staggered now. That's good. Things are working out a little better now that I'm reading. Okay. Set him on fire. Now's the time, so we're going to do this. Even though we really need to be focusing on th things like... Um... Okay, so they're going to recover. They're both at 14%, which is great. Well, 14 health. Okay, so what do we have? You both have... Okay, no, you don't. All right, I'm going to try to... Nope, I can't. Fuck me. On... Okay, I'm going to do this. Meanwhile, I'm going to do this. Let's see what happens here. Okay, good. Oh, no, that was bad. Okay, oh, fragile. Take two additional damage from... Okay, that's going to hurt me a little bit. But not a lot of it, which is kind of what's important. All right, so this will be okay. All right, let's let's uh, see what happens. I think I got what it takes. Yeah, just plow through their shield a little bit. Boom, he's staggered. He's at one HP, but he can't die. What was that? Oh, it's because of the, okay. So he's at one, so we just need to get him down. All right, so this is how I got to do it, which I don't think is going to work, but we will try it. He is going to lose five health regardless, though. Okay. Hey, there we go. I did it. Holy shit. Okay. Whew. That went by way better. And we got some new bonuses, which is... Oh, now I have to talk. And I'm bad at that. Hey, did you know that art is in it's, it's Hey, did you know that art is inseparable from alcohol? Oh yeah, I heard that. They say art is still all about flashes of inspiration, right? You know it. Maybe we're on the same page after all. Oh, you brought a different booze this time. Absinthe? Oh, I actually like absinthe. Absinthe is really nice. This is the liquor with a legacy that's so deeply tied to art, it's almost legendary. 
Since I'm in charge of arts, I could use some stimulation to work like a real artist. This one's pretty strong, but it's charming nonetheless. What if Angela scolds us like this? Like the last time, though. Hey, we can worry about that later. Works for me. By the way, just thought I'd mention, there's no need to worry about courtesy and stuff with me. I'd say it's more comfortable for me to go with courtesy. Alright then. Look at this glowing green liquor. It's just like the arts of the city. Imitations that are proactive, but nothing else. Imitations of intimate Im imitations, in fact. Though I don't see the point in being original either. I'm likely someone or something else's imitation too. As if stuff like originality or arts ever even matters in the city on in the first place. All those self-proclaimed artists are nutcases. They seem to be mistaking any stimulation as stronger than usual for art. Just like how I'm praising this drink as a work of art. The pianist must be must have been in one hell of a stimula stim stimulant then. I heard that its music was a hair-raising masterpiece that awoke this gray city from its ennui. Well, the intensity was unpre unprecedented. That's for sure. And some are still hung over from the performance. Like they were slammed with the real strong booze. How about you? I must be one of them, I suppose. I never heard of that kind of music before. I guess you've taken a liking to art seeing as you're talking about all this. True. If I could choose one living one to if I could choose one if I could choose to live a different life, I might have been a painter or something. Painter, huh? <clears throat> I'd be able to quickly express all my emotions on the painting. Maybe I could have lived a humble life just like that. Hey, Nedzak, um, you want to join me for an evening of uh, drinking and painting up Warhammer minis? I think it'd be right up your alley. I have a few that need painting right now that I'm kind of falling behind on. ADHD's fun. And how did a modest man like yourself end up getting involved in something as grandiose as curing humanity? I, it really is a mystery. I'm not even sure myself. I think I wanted to be uh, of help to someone. Oh, a, a someone. Perhaps your first love. Was, was it love? Really? Even if it were, I wouldn't have worked. It wouldn't have worked out anyway. But I was still holding on to hope that I could make something better. That if I let go of my life, I could bring a bigger hope to some other person. That's why I participated in this research. That's why I stood against Angela. <clears throat> oh. How much exposition am I getting this episode, I wonder? Isn't it about time we ended this stalemate? We're at the dawn of the fourth day. If you're if you are if you are to drag on any further. I'll be left with no other choice but to terminate all of you instantly. <clears throat> I'm with you on this one. We're never going to beat you at this rate. I didn't fight to spread only a, a meager half of the light. God, which one's... Oh, yeah, that's... I, I'm sorry, Hot. I keep forgetting everyone's name. It's... I just woke up not that long ago. Okay, give me a break. Gebra, how could you agree with her? We might lose everything. I'm with Angela too. Enoch's death deserves to a better meaning than this half-baked light. I am not. I'm not willing to gamble with everyone. Everything we've worked for. Say, Angela. If what you're saying is true, does that mean the employees who died in this place come back as well? Indeed. 
and your employees will all wake up with brand new bodies. That doesn't erase all the pain we and the employees went through. And all our hard work, too. Even if this... Even if this... Uh, God, which... I keep forgetting, he has a very particular ac accent. The voice I'm trying to imitate with him, this is probably going to be way off from the actual actor, is um, Matt Smith from Doctor Who. So I have to like get into that every time I think of him. Even if, even if this deal were to be put through, it will only delay the inevitable. Hakma, 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 Hakma. How can we trust that you, you? How can we trust you not to betray us yet again? Betray? Don't be absurd. Have we ever once gathered around the table calmly discussing what we should do with this light? We haven't. I'll make sure to keep you this promise, though. Both you and I require the light in this hole, albeit for different reasons. I could use up this residue of light left for me right now, but I'd much prefer to have it all. Have all of it. So I'd like to live more. I don't care if you want to die or not. I want to live my own life. And I'd like to learn a learn more about the city and about this world I live in. Angela. Once we've reclaimed, reclaimed once we've reclaimed all of the light, you are free to lay judgment upon me when that time comes. Though I won't sit back, of course. That is all I have to offer. I have a feeling that's foreshadowing for something in the future. If no one else objects, I'll proceed with the right with it right away. I shall become a sentinel once more and watch your every action. It appears that all, we all have come to an agreement. Don't worry. I have no plans to let this end be the end. Life will call out to you once again. So, take a nap until then. Whoever says out loud they want to die is just lying they actually want to live m more than anyone so they experience that urge in one way or another on the other hand when someone is genuinely willing to die they end up disappearing silently when Angela said she wanted to live I felt something within me that I want to live too no one really wants to die, man. They all seem to regret that it uh, like m moments. <laughs> they all seem to regret it moments before death. Well, it's usually too late for them by the time they realize it. <clears throat> you seem very well versed in that kind of stuff. You get to see all kinds of people when you work as a fixer. When I saw that desperation to live, I was reminded of the many employees who died right in front of my eyes back in Lobotomy Corporation. It's iconic. How, it's ironic how we were, we were trying to save humanity, yet couldn't save the people right next to us. That's when I thought. If I could live more, what would I want to do? It's a good idea to think about your next move, yeah. <clears throat> How about you, Roland? Are you going to go back to being a fixer once you're free? Well, I have to think more on that, but I still have a long way to go. Let's give it our best shot. Alright, here's to us! I can test that, alright. Here's to us. God, I love voice acting for Netzak, especially when drunk. We are now an urban plague. Oh! Yay. Thelma, dear. It's all thanks to me that you have come... You could keep your promise. I don't know what, am I, what I'm reading. It's all distorted. 
Well, my dear, it's all thanks to me that you could keep your position as head of the Southern Branch. So, maybe you should return some, some of that favor, no? I know. That was the deal. What do you want this time? I want your crew to take care of one thing on this list. I think I might be able to locate it soon enough. These are all ridiculous requests. Well, though we have the right team for this. Let me guess, section two? Oh shit, I didn't read that. Yes. See, I am a very, see, I'm a very considerate person, Thelma. The library is on the list as well. Now appointed as urban plague by the Henna Association. That's the one. I am particularly interested in it, actually. <laughs> it's probably because I've been doing a little bit of grinding off camera that this is happening. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section below what's going on. Roland? Yeah, huh? If your estimation is correct, we'll have to thoroughly prepare ourselves for guests from major syndicates and even wings from now on, right? That was the third most surprising thing to happen to me here. What nonsense are you going on about this time? You just called me Roland. Because that's your name. I mean, yeah, but you've never referred to me with my name before. My level of trust for you has increased, and I wanted to reinforce your enmity, so I tried referring to you in, your re in relatively more intimate terms. Is that a problem? Come on. That's a boring answer. It's been a long while since anyone called me by my name. Still, the last time I heard that was from my family, I guess. <clears throat> Didn't you say your grandma disappeared long ago? <clears throat> oh, I had a wife, you see. That's intriguing. Go on. <clears> hmm? <throat> You're not intrigued by the fact that someone like me managed to get married, right? You're intrigued by the whole concept of this inefficient... Come on, learning disability. Practice among humans known as marriage, right? <clears throat> Please tell me more about your marriage. Just a heads up, it's an overall battle story with some, some sad moments. Don't think you really like it. I'm always open for new stories of others. <clears throat> Says the one who won't even tell me the story of her own life. I can't bring myself to recount th that story ever again. I'm simply too sick of it. It's a boring and trifling story that looped over and over for ten millennia. Imagine reading the same book for one million years. You'll surely grow to resent it. I'd have choked myself by the tie around my fifth time I'd be forced to read the, uh, read a boring book. Well, anyway, I used to work my ass off. Had nothing better to do. I wasn't a bad fixer for fixer work, coming from a rough background and all. As I keep wor kept working like a busy bee, I got a house in a decent spot and met a so-called soulmate. She was such a tough woman. Was it Gebra? Was it Gebra your boo? Cause she's mine, you know. When I looked at when I looked at her back, I felt what did I just read? When I looked at her back. So it is Gebra. She's mine now. Stay away. I felt the comfort of finding a place to belong. Something I couldn't feel even if I bought my house my house house home. House home. My homey house. I made so many attempts to try and catch her attention. Oh, Am I dragging out, dragging on too long? It's fine, please continue. Well, hello. <laughs> I did get a bunch of uh, opportunities to see her since we were in the same industry. My wife was a pretty highly graded fixer, but I, by the way, she was dependable for a reason. Anyway, countless ups and downs later, we tried, we tied the knot. I put, I put it simply here, but the heartache I felt in those twists and turns was real, you know. 
both of us had piled up a hefty amount of money for working like dogs. So we decided to quit being fixers for a while and spend a peaceful time together. <clears throat> this part is kind of corny, but happy is the word to describe how I felt, really. I was alone by my whole life. And finally, I had someone to rely on. All we had to worry about was what to have for lunch. Where to take a stroll in the evening, what to name our child and stuff. <clears throat> then one day, I got an urgent call from a friend asking me to do a request from far away from home. You can probably guess where the story is going by now. <clears throat> the job wasn't a huge deal and the pay was all right, so I decided to take it. The lady who lived with me said okay too. I was dispatched to see to a district famous for Pageon, <coughs> which was my wife's favorite food. I could almost see her mouth water with the thought of eating it when I when she when she set me off. To live up to my better half's expectations, I purchased a stasis prevention box from U Corp to present to her as, with a warm pageon that's straight from the kitchen. But a huge incident occurred in my home district while I was away. The house collapsed, and my wife died along with our child she was still pregnant with. She cried for a long while, cursing the world and the city. I writhed and struggled, trying to earn this happiness. So why does it have to slip out of my hands so easily? You know, that has to suck. I, I really do feel for Roland right now. Also, I've been here for 30 minutes. There's a lot of exposition. <clears throat> Alright, that's the end of my story. Hmm? This kind of stuff can happen to anyone in this city. It's only a matter of endurance. And you can endure that trial? I'm trying to settle it on my own terms. What was the second most surprising thing to ha for you, by, by the way? Hmm? Oh, that working, her working here suits me better than I thought, I guess. I'm saving the biggest surprise for last. It's no fun to spoil everything, is it? At once, is it? Fine, then. I'll let you. I'll leave you with your sorting. The I'll leave you with sorting the rest of the books. You can now transfer passive abilities. Oh, well, that's neat. I'll figure that out next time. Also, my volume's super loud for some reason, and it's not going down. Great. Uh, my headphones are deciding to work. Okay, so a lot of HP recovery. Um, on death, all characters take 25% of this character's max HP as damage. Interesting. So a lot of HP recovering and sharing. So you're just meant to endure a lot of stuff. I will build you guys up later. I'm not pitting the drunks against each other, but I am going to try to take out the Scots again. All right, so let me take out these Scots real quick. And then we will get to all that stuff. And this time we can just skip all the exposition. Okay, we're not doing that. I think I'll have to rely on Yesod. I only get one attempt, Yesod, so don't screw this up. Okay, so they can completely reshuffle their hands. At the end of each scene, restore one light. Okay. And so, okay, these guys synergize really well, which I think is kind of where I struggle. Everyone's going after that. So I'm going to, okay, I can't interrupt that, but I can, hmm. Only using one light. So if I take this, okay, I will clash back at that. Okay, I'm going to focus strike on this. God, I really did not... These robot ones are really shit. I'm pretty sure that I'm going to... Ow! 
Jesus Christ, don't get staggered already. God. Yeah, they're trying to focus their way into getting Yesod taken care of. Okay, we're going to have to do that. Try to stop him, but I don't think that's gonna work. God, this one's, this card sucks. I don't know why I keep using it. It just sucks. All right, let's see where we are. Okay, yes, odds gonna, yep. Shit. All right, so I don't think I'm going to be able to have Yesod for too much longer. So, hmm. I think we're gonna need to rely more on staggers and I'm going to give it to this guy in particular, especially since I'm pretty sure Yesod's not surviving this. Yeah, no, he's not. I'm gonna do some light defense and we're just gonna call it a day on that because there's not much else I can do. Sorry, Yesod. Oh, God damn it. Ow. Oh, wait, that's not me. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. Um. Okay, so she's staggered. They really want to take them out, so. Uh, I don't really have anything that can take her out right now. Which sucks. But I can do. Uh. This. I might as well. She's staggered. Okay. Foos. What the hell? Bullshit. That was... A... <sighs> whatever. Just make it fast. You know, just do whatever. I don't care anymore. This made no damn sense. Like none. I don't fucking get it. <sighs> What exactly am I doing wrong? Like, seriously, what? It makes no fucking sense. I hate to get mad over this shit, but... It's... It needs to... Well, that's gonna handicap me a lot. Fucking awesome. The game's got me so flustered that I literally can't focus now. I definitely need to get rid of You Only Live Once, I guess, but... Whatever. Okay, since Yesod's doing good. Uh, set it on fire. I think that should be fine. That's way too much. That should actually take you out. But I doubt it will because that's not how this game works apparently. Yeah, I'm just going to remove all the robot cards from the deck because I think that's what's getting me. Because these robot ones are just horrible. They really are. I remember all of you guys telling me not to focus on one enemy at a time. See how that... Alright. But yeah, so the whole thing... Is that... If... If your gameplay mechanics are so complicated... That it's... I can't just pick it up. That's... That's a bad thing. We are this far in, and it's... And, like, it's almost as if nothing has been explained. <laughs> like, most of the information about the game I've gotten from you guys. Nope. And that's... That's the end of him. I get making challenging games and all that shit. I do. But, um... There's just a certain point where it's just... You're trying too hard. Like... I've literally been sitting here trying to collect my thoughts because this is the second time I've had to go through this shit. I don't know why I didn't give the other guy anything to do, but whatever. It's not like this guy's gonna survive. How are you surviving with bleed on you? Bullshit. Kill her, please. Thank you. There's one down. Hit it hard. 
Yeah, there we go, finally. Where are my thoughts right now? Because I don't even know. It's just... That... That just so fucking stupid. That's all I can say, is that this is fucking stupid. With all the sh fucking farming I've done, I still can't get a goddamn deck. That just works. Screw it, I'll just burn these books. I don't give a shit. Burn them. Give me something that I can use. Sands page. whoop de fucking do Yeah, I think these might be a little bit better for... Um, okay. So, let me go, and I will go to my library. Where is Netzak? Okay, I need... Not you. Um, I'm sorry. You need to get these gone, because they fucking suck. Give one protection. That would be useful. I'll try you out, even though you're literally the only one I've got. What the hell? Replaces all dice on this page with ones at random paid on a random page. And who it costs is four or lower. Excluding counter dice. I'll give you a shot. This focus strike, I'm actually going to go ahead and replace you with a brawl. Um, I think I need a little bit more of this. I love this, but this works pretty well and has a little bit of defensive capabilities. That's great. This needs to go away, because we've already established that it's stupid. Again, I'll give that a try. I'm actually taking way longer on this than I wanted to. But the whole goal is to... Book of Julia. I need more Book of Sands. Oh no. I have a book of... I had a book of distortion. Didn't I have a book of distortion? I got the book of distortion. What more do you fucking want? What? Uh, what? Don't I? Oh, it's already okay. Okay, never mind. I'm stupid. I was okay. We're fine. Okay, so don't clash. Don't clash and don't clash. Good. Got it. All right. Don't clash, guys. It's pretty much like they're going to absorb one HP every time I clash with them. Okay, so I can overpower you, which might be my best. Okay, I get to see what this does right away. No one's going after you, so I can just piggyback. Um, what are you doing? Boing, boing, boing. Okay, mm, I'll go with this because it's literally my only shot. Boom. That was interesting. Yeah, there's just way too much stuff to remember in this game, so I'm just gonna lose a lot. And you guys wonder why I try to pick, like, the, uh, full force freaking ones? It's specifically because I already have so much shit to remember, and you're expecting me, a guy with ADHD, to remember all of it? Alright, so I'm gonna give this a shot, see what happens. Oh, good. Good, good thing I put that on there. Okay, I don't know if I've been interrupted yet. Nope. Whoa! That was violent. Okay, so there is a blunt attack on that. There's also a blunt attack on this. Okay, boom. Let's see, boom, boom. Okay, good, good. Nope. Okay, so it's rolling the dice each time. I did not know that. So I still have to... It still comes down to luck, which I kind of fucking hate. Alright, so that's what it means by the power dice. Okay. Now that that's been explained to me in great detail, after the fact, I now know what I need to do. Blow these sons of bitches up. I'm not paralyzed. I seem to be struck by you. Boom. Alright, there we go. Doink. Oh god, no. No. No, that was a bad idea. Well, he didn't dodge that. What does Paralysis do? Does it actually do anything? Okay, so he's going to defend and do that. I'm going to go the opposite direction. Okay, we'll give you some more strength next scene. Just because we know he's going to survive. Boom. Alright, I think that's good. Set on fire. Uh, deflect. Um, that's not going to clash, I don't think. I'll hold off on that for now. Just poke him. Stagger deflect. What? I don't know what that means. He, oh, he deflected and then got staggered. It's okay. 
Is he still going to be staggered when I go into um, the next round? All right, so this is going to be tough. We need to focus our efforts. That's not going to work. Okay, so he's going to interrupt that. And he cannot, however, interrupt this. All right, this, is a, this will be an interesting play out. I can't wait to see what happens. Really wish they would, like, do all this stuff slower so I could actually catch all of it. Boom. He rolled a freaking nine, which is epic. Boom. 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 All right, we got somebody staggered, which is really good. Okay, now to slow things down. Okay, I'm actually going to use this, and I'm going to use it on one of you two. Probably you. I just realized that you have absolutely nothing for armor, and somehow you're surviving. How have we done this? Well, you're going to get used first, so we're going to try to take them down. Try to interrupt this. Okay, we're going to rampage out on this and see if we can't interrupt. What are you doing? Okay. Boom. You're staggered. Interrupt. Yeah. And death. Oh, you're still alive. Well, you're not going to survive much longer, so... I'm sorry. Alright, so we just got one act left. How much you want to bet? Nope. Gonna ignore him. Okay, we need to interrupt this. Uh, Try it. I don't think it'll work, but try it. You never know. Um, Do this. Go! Okay, we interrupted. That's good. All right, so. All right, so you're going for that. Poke him. All right, brawl, and let's see. Ah, blow it up. We're at the easy part of the day. Why is this so easy, but the freaking Scots, drunken Scotsman is hard to take down. There we go. All right, I'm going to try. Actually, no, I'm not going to do that because I don't actually have time for it now. But hey, you got to see that and gained a book of low Anatomy corporation. Fuck, I hope so. I'm gonna burn some books. So literally you guys have just been seeing me figure stuff out live, which I guess is fun. <laughs> burn them. Purple is a good sign. Okay, I did kind of like this one slightly. Isadora slash stagger damage plus one. Cool. I think I need to be using those. All right, so I need to rebuild um, Yesod's level a little bit. I'm not quite there, and I don't freaking get what was going on the last time, but then again, I, I'm still trying to speed things along because... Um, it's, it's mainly just for editing purposes, so hopefully you guys don't mind that, but yeah. I do have quite a bit of stuff left today to do. I actually have one more recording. Then I have to go and make a character for a D&D session today, so kind of pressed for time, so part of it's my fault, but yes. I still think that this game still has to make things a lot... It needs to explain things a lot better. Like, yes, I know part of my problem is I don't want to read stuff, but yeah... Clash damage was never explained to me. Clashing and stuff was never explained. It's still not entirely clear how that happens. So, and it also wasn't apparent that they were re-rolling dice because it was happening so fast. So if there was a way that they could slow the animations down, I think that would be even better. In fact, maybe there is a setting that I'm missing in here that can slow the animations down. Maybe. Uh, the answer is no. There is no freaking way to slow the animations down. That is... Kind of sad. There's also a manual, but I, God knows I'm not reading that. So again, I need to go and practice some more offline, which I still haven't done. But, you know, when you have full-time work and you're trying to run a YouTube channel, it's hard to do. And next week, I'm going to try to stick to hour-long episodes if I can. So the, the whole idea is that there's so much reading that goes into this right now. So I'm going to try to make room for more story and more encounters. So if you guys want to see more of this, make sure you're subscribed and leave a comment in the comments section below or go join us over on Discord where you can actually post your memes for, <clears throat> oh, sorry, the Butter Me Corporation gaming and a whole bunch of other stuff. Also, starting this week, next week, I'm not sure, 
Starting at some point, I should might be live streaming on YouTube, so stay tuned for that. And if you want to support my efforts here, you can support me over on Patreon, and I've got Amazon wishlists and stuff linked below just for that occasion, and I'm going to jump off here. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching, and if you enjoyed it, feel free to show me some love down below by hitting the like button, and don't forget to check out the annotations for more videos. Now we'll see you in the next video.